Over the last couple of months, my divine counterpart and I have been exchanging unconditional love through our heart chakra, and this has been uh, beneficial for both of us. I think it's brought us some comfort. Um, but we still have our rocky moments, like yesterday on the drive home after work, Billy Idol's White Wedding song came on the radio, and I was wondering why so many people actually played this at weddings, and it just didn't make any sense to me because the song doesn't really appeal to me. But my divine counterpart actually panicked about a wedding, and I didn't understand. He was absolutely panicked about getting married to me. And I was like, why is he totally panicking about this? There's nothing to panic about. Spirits brought us this far in our journey so that we would learn to love ourselves and become our true authentic selves. Why is he suddenly panicking about losing himself in a marriage? And of course, my insecurities took it to the next level of, oh, there's a problem with me. It's me he doesn't want to marry. But I recognized immediately that this was not the issue. It had nothing to do with me. And even though I recognized this with his own fear of commitment, the feelings that it created within myself persisted throughout the evening and then again throughout today. Getting married is not on the forefront of my mind at the moment, being that we haven't even met yet in the 3D. Also, we're already married. We were married before we were incarnated here on Earth. So right now, our biggest concern is focusing on our soul's purpose and why we're here. And I have really been struggling with my soul's purpose this last little while. I know I'm supposed to start singing again, but I really don't know to what end or to what purpose. I know it's tied into healing somehow, but I really don't have any direction. I know there's a lot of people that are struggling with this same thing. We're so used to being told what to do for our entire lives. We feel we need this absolute direction of which way to go. It's like being thrown into a free roam video game for the very first time when you've been playing linear storyline games for so long. And in this free roam game, you can go anywhere, do anything, and you just don't know where to start. And the difference is, in reality, you can't go back to your last save point to redo something. So if you're feeling overwhelmed or like you're struggling or you're stuck, just remember to take one small step forward each day. And for those days where you feel like you can't do that one small step, have compassion for yourself and some understanding. Because there's always going to be days that are better than others. Remember that the divine loves you and wants your happiness. And they've got your back. And to my counterpart, whose heart is attached to mine, I've got you. <laughs>